communications has just been restored with the, the uh, research vehicle. Um, Jeb did it. They did it. They found Bob. Everyone's safe and sound back on the vehicle. And now we just got to bring them home. Uh, supplies are looking good, except fuel is critical. And we, uh, we're going to try to arrow break this thing. There's not enough fuel left for anything else. <laughs> the leading edge is uh, getting a little toasty warm as it hits the upper uh, curb in atmosphere. Um, yeah, with uh, with so little fuel on board and there's no heat shield on the vehicle, we've got to do this slowly and carefully. So this is going to take multiple passes through the atmosphere to bring the uh, orbit down. Uh, luckily, they've got uh, plenty of supplies, uh, aside from a reported shortage of cream-filled yellow cakes. Uh, outside of that, they, uh, they've got about six to seven days worth of supplies left on board, so we can pretty much take as long as we need. Well, that's got our Apple apps where we want it. Now we need to bring the uh, Perry apps up to circularize. And by some miracle that didn't even use up the last of our fuel, we've uh, we've still got a whole ooh, 20 liters of liquid fuel left on board. Getting close to the station, uh, we just need to cancel our relative motion now and uh, plot our intercept, and then we can bring her into dock. And uh, well, we got to figure out what'll happen next. All right. Final approach with Skylab 1. Um, let's see. We appear to be approaching broadside on. And the we know there's a fuel tanker docked to the end with the, um, the solar arrays on them. So we're going to want to uh, slew around to the left side, our left side, and come around on the unoccupied uh, docking ports at the stern of uh, Skylab 1. Let's see, get ourselves level with the station. And <laughs> we're, uh, with the rear engines uh, empty like that, we're, we're horribly unbalanced front to rear. Um, perhaps future designs, design iterations will, uh, will correct that problem. But there's not much we can do about it now. Okay, now we want to keep an eye on things. Uh, so the plan is we are going to slew the nose around at the same rate as Skylab 1 is crossing our field of view. And as soon as the docking ports all li are all lined up, we'll use a combination of uh, SAS, RCS, and the main engine to cancel our relative motion. And then all we'll have to do is just slowly bring her in and, uh, and dock. And then we can start working at uh, refueling the craft and uh, you know, getting the crew off there. Uh, medical's wanting to take a look at Bob. Uh, there's quite a bit of concerns with him. And it worked. Well, you know, first try. Good thing, too. We're down to 30% uh, monopropellant and uh, about 10 liters of liquid fuel. But we're almost there. We could... Uh, it would uh, I would have to screw this up pretty badly not to get these docked up now. <sighs> Honestly, at uh, we're at the end of, of quite the uh, quite the little adventure. Um, we've got some other missions coming up, and I'm uh, I'm hoping to take a little bit of a break from the heavy drama. But until next time. <laughs>